Today we're doing 4.1, classifying triangles, and we're going to be able to classify triangles by sides and by angles. Okay, so our vocab words for this one is a triangle. It's a figure formed by three segments joining three non-collinear points. So remember, that means they're not in a line, non-collinear. We have an equilateral triangle, equa, you know, equal, and then lateral means side, so three congruent sides. Isosceles, at least two congruent sides. Scalene has no congruent sides. An acute triangle has three acute angles. Obtuse triangle has one obtuse angle, and a right triangle has one right angle. And then we have a vertex of a triangle is the point that joins two sides of a triangle is the vertex. So we can classify by sides. If, so we have our three types to classify by sides. Our first one's equilateral, three congruent sides. Isosceles, at least two congruent sides, and we have scalene, which has no congruent sides. First one up, if you are classifying it by sides, do we have any congruent sides in our first picture? No. No, so which one had no congruent sides? Scalene. Scalene. Okay, our next one up, how many congruent sides do we have? Three. Three congruent sides, and that is which one? Equilateral. Okay, and then our last one, how many congruent sides do we have? Two. Two congruent sides, and what do we call that one? Isosceles. Isosceles. Okay, so we see no congruent sides, scalene, three congruent sides, equilateral, two congruent sides, isosceles. We're going to classify these by sides. So in picture one, how many congruent sides do we have? Two congruent sides. What do we call two congruent sides? Isosceles. Okay, and number two, you have how many congruent sides? Three congruent sides. And how, what do we call three congruent sides? Equilateral. Okay, and number three, how many congruent sides do we have? None. No congruent sides. What do we call that? Scalene. Scalene. Okay, and last but not least, how many congruent sides do we have in number four? None. None. So no congruent sides. What do we call it? Scalene. Scalene. If you are classifying by angles, we look at our first picture. It's an equiangular, equa, equal, angular angles. So you have three congruent angles. You have an acute triangle. It has three acute angles. All the angles are less than 90 degrees. A right triangle have exactly one right angle. And an obtuse angle will have one obtuse angle. Okay, so our first one up, what are we going to classify it by if we are classifying it by angles? It is a right triangle because it has a right box telling us that it is a right angle. So a right triangle. Our next one up, well, how would we classify this one? Equal yep, we have three equal angles, so we call it equiangular. Triangle. Three equal angles. And then our last one. Do you have an angle that's bigger than 90 degrees? Nope. Nope, it's going to be acute. All less than 90 degrees, so it's an acute triangle. Yep, so the first one we see has those congruent marks. It tells us we have three congruent angles. So you know it's equiangular. Our second one up, it's going to be obtuse because you have one angle that's greater than 90. So it's going to be an obtuse triangle. And then our last one, acute. It's an acute triangle. All angles are less than 90 degrees. 